he'd be back in D.C. You know, I'm just thinking, man, this is, this is an election year. I'm asking you, your white guy, do you know who you're voting for yet? Don't know, do you? Now, you see that? You see what just happened here? Let me tell you something. That is a cultural thing. He knows who he's going to vote for. He's just not going to tell me. See? I've noticed that. That is a cultural thing. White people do not like to talk about their political affiliations. It's a secret. You ever ask a white guy who's voting for you? Hey, Bob, uh, Bob, who are you going to vote for? Dave, Dave, whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, take it easy now. Take it easy. So anyway, um, I was fucking my wife in her ass, right? And, and I mean, it was something else. Yeah, 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 but, but, but who are you voting for? Dave! Dave, come on with the voting. I'm trying to tell you about fucking my wife here. Ask me all these personal questions. They don't like to divulge that information because it matters to them. Black people talk about that shit. Black people will openly talk about politics. Black people will openly talk about beating up politicians and shit. <laughs> if I see George Bush, I'll kick his motherfucking ass for cutting my Medicaid. <laughs> oh, okay, 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 okay. Black people just say it. But there's a reason for that. It matters more for that. It matters more. Black people, see, see, even when I vote right, which I don't, but, but, <laughs> But even when I like think about like who I would vote for, right? I don't even look at their political policies. I just look at their character. You know what I'm saying now? You gotta read, no, I'm serious. You gotta read between the lines. Like, you know, you look at Clinton and black people like Clinton because we've seen him on the campaign. I saw one thing on the campaign trail. He, he actually just picked a black baby up and kissed him. Come here, you little nigger baby. Mwah! Just kiss him. I said, mm hmm I like that. He did not hesitate or nothing. You see George Bush Jr., he be that, oh. <laughs> oh but. Like, see, I'd never vote for George Bush Jr., but I don't know George Bush Jr.'s politics. The only thing I know about George Bush Jr. is that that guy Sniff cocaine, that's right. Now listen, we cannot have that shit in the White House. That might be fine for a mayor, but God damn it, not in the White House. Not in the White House. Mm -mm. You know what I'm saying? The stakes are too high in the White House. You can't have no coke head president. Mm -mm. He be selling nuclear secrets for twenty, thirty dollars and shit. <laughs> he be in meetings embarrassing America. Come on, sign the treaty, baby. <laughs> I suck your dick. Like what the? <laughs> Mr. President. <laughs> Mr. President, that is not how we do business here, sir. Stop sucking the ambassador's dick. <laughs> no, let him finish. I will sign the treaty. There will be peace in Israel finally. <laughs>